Hey folks, Keep the 93 Lumber coming back at you with another beer. Um, this, this was given to me by Matt from Mass Beer, Mass, uh, Mass Beers. <clears throat> um, he was given this um, from, I believe, Oak Ridge. I don't know if that's a that's a nickname or or what that is, but I believe he is someone he's someone who uh, frequently gives Matt beer, and he put one of these in the box for me. So then Matt gave it to me. So thank you, Matt, and thank you, Oak Ridge, if I am remembering that correctly, or if it was someone else. I have no idea. Uh, or I'm sorry if it was someone else, but thank you nonetheless. Uh, this is Fox Farm Brewery. Uh, it is their quiet night, Czech style dark lager. Uh, Fox Farm Brewery, Salem, Connecticut. Government warning. From the soils come the spoils. 5.3% alcohol by volume. Oh, excuse me. Uh, keep cold, drink fresh. Oh, yes, that's what I should look at. Uh... I want to say that this says 1202 2020. So that would make this like one, two, almost, almost three months old. Almost. But that's if that's a 12. It, it got cut off. So, uh, yeah. It looks like it's either a, a 10 or 12. So, so it's either almost three months old or five months old but anyway thank you nonetheless to both um there's a little bit of water in there i rinsed it out a little bit um thanks to oak ridge and matt Um, that's dark. Get a little bit of like, oh no, oh I keep getting a little bit through it. Uh, dark, dark reddish brown is what I'm seeing. I'm getting it around the edges, but I'm also getting a tiny bit through the center. So, or is that the center or is that the sides? Can't tell. It's kind of like there's like a reflection. No, it's definitely through the, I think. Yeah, through the center. Maybe not. Maybe it's reflecting off the bottom. It's hard to tell. It's dark, but I'm getting a little bit of reddish brown around. I'll just say around the edges. Um, just under a finger of about. Mm, I wish all heads were white so I could just say white because I'm terrible at thinking of things. Um, let's see. What do like khaki? Is is that? I know Matt says gaggy to describe it, so yeah, yeah, close enough, right? Looks good though. We'll see what it smells like. It's probably too cold. I should have taken it out a little sooner, or not sooner, a little earlier. Getting a nice bitterness. I want to say a little bit of like uh, chocolate. Maybe like stone ground chocolate. There is a nice uh, 
I assume it's I assume it's from the the yeast and not the malt, but there's like this nice like straw hay thing. It's very like farmhousey without the without the um without like the tartness. Yeah. Maybe a little bit of roastiness too in, in there with the, the chocolate and the roastiness and the bitterness. This little thing. Yeah, let's get into it. Uh, thank you again, Matt, for giving this to me. And thank you, Oak Ridge, for giving it to Matt for me. Uh, cheers. This is so good. It's really smooth. And with that like chocolate thing in there, it like kind of, it's kind of reminding me of like chocolate milk. <laughs> there is a little bitterness little bit of a bitterness um that also might be why it's like reminding me of like chocolate milk because the bitterness is not as the the bitterness in the in the aroma was was a lot bigger than it wasn't it wasn't big in the aroma but based on the aroma i thought the bitterness was going to be bigger um man If you took like a cold brew coffee and just put a bunch of like Hershey's, uh, like not her not Hershey's like better 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 quality like chocolate syrup, but like it's kind of giving me those those vibes. It's actually this is actually this is crazy. This is crazy good. Super drinkable. I could chug this all day. The only thing I would want this is like 1% less alcohol. Like give me give me this at 4%. But I am not complaining at all. I'm surprised I'm not getting like a lot a lot of like I mean obviously it's a lager it's it has <clears throat> the um, general lager vibes that you get from get from lagers um, but that like straw hay thing in the aroma was so big that because that was the biggest thing in the aroma. And I'm surprised that this is like super smooth. It's not giving me like huge lager vibes. Obviously it tastes like a lager, but. But the. Maybe it is from the malt. Because hmm. now it's coming off a little more, uh, a little more bready. Um, all I know is that this is super good. I'm probably drinking it too cold. It's probably even better when it's a little warm, a little more warm. But, uh, So good. It's like chocolate coffee lager. Yeah. 
that's about it. Uh, let's see. Um, I hope you're staying safe. I hope you're well. I hope you are taking care of yourself if you're sharing space with people or another person. I hope you're all taking care of each other. You can like this video if you would like to. You can <clears throat> you can subscribe to the channel if you have not already. You can follow me on Instagram at 93lumber. That's spelled out, 93lumber. Um, and uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next one. Thank you, Matt. Thank you, Oak Ridge. Cheers.